Hi, uh, this is Eunice the Herbalist Stylist and I'm here at Chauvet Hair Studio with my sister Janet. Um, she's been here a couple weeks now and um, we've been discussing hair and um, her hair damage and so forth. So we decided, to, well I decided to do a video on this so that, you know, we can have a three part um, to get, you know, in showing the transformation of her, you know, hair beard and so forth. So, um, yeah, um, we're going to be talking about rosemary. Uh, I'm a big believer in rosemary uh, products for the hair. Rosemary is really great for the hair. And uh, what it's going to do for Gina is going to give her, uh, it's going to help improve her shine, uh, soften her hair. And uh, it's also an antibacterial. It's also going to help block, you know, uh, prevent some of the gray. She, she says she's already gray, but and she is, but it'll help. So anyway, uh, and rosemary above all is also going to stimulate growth. So we're going to do that and uh, right now we are sitting here to uh, discuss the steps that we're going to be taking for this transformation stuff. So I'm letting Jeanette say a few words. Say, Jeanette, let them know how well or how happy you are in back in Florida. Oh, I love being back in Florida. It's just like a vacation every day. Oh, okay. Oh, it's nice. The weather's good. Oh, I'm good. <laughs> so, um, the steps that we're going to take to help Jeanette get her hair back, the hair that she loves and so forth, so that she can go flip back and forth uh, from wigs to her natural hair, wearing her natural hair and so forth, is going to be simple. Uh, we're going to do a relaxer. Uh, but before we do the relax, we're going to like uh, pull on through her hair, her follicles and so forth, so that uh, her hair does not get over processed or so far because uh, her hair is very dry right now, very brittle. So we need to take that extra step in caring for her hair before we even start anything. So we're going to do that. Once we do the relaxer and get all the relaxing products out of her hair, we're going to do the rosemary rinse. We're going to let her sit for like five minutes under the cap uh, while the rosemary uh, rinse stimulate and uh, her scalp and infuse her follicles and so forth. And uh, after that, we're going to do a deep condition, uh, which is going to be about 15 20 minutes again under the cap. Uh, but what we want to do there is just moisten her hair, moisturize her hair, and give her hair the extra um, love and so forth by, you know, giving her a deep uh, condition, uh, deep condition. I'm getting ready to get carried away that with the massage. <laughs> anyway, okay, so once we do that, we're also going to put on her back under the cap a third time. I know Jeanette's saying, oh, 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 the cap, 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 she don't hate to sit still, but this is going to be a kind of a long transformation for her and so forth, so she's just going to have to sit there on the cap, and so forth, at least she's not on the dryer, <laughs> yeah, okay, so we're going to put her back on the um, cap for a five minute rosemary oil treatment, and so forth, we're going to do rosemary oil treatment, and so forth, so these are things that's going to help improve her hair, her hair is very dry, very damaged right now, and so uh, we're trying to get her hair back to the natural state, so that she can shed her wig if she wants to. And um, also, our part two is where we're actually going to do the actual relaxer and, uh, you know, go through the rosemary steps and stuff under the cap and all that. We're going to be doing that so uh, that she can, you know, uh, we can show you uh, the transformation and so forth, show you her hair after we're done. Now, we're also excited about the part three because Janet also wants, a sew in. She's never had a soap in, so she wants to get a sew in. And uh, I think it's going to be a partial sew in, say, Jeanette. It's going to be a partial sew in. Well, I would really like a full sew in and the hair so it could be not curly but then uh, So she probably could look more. Okay. Mm. So, anyway, um, we're going to do that um, for Janet. We're going to do the um, sew-in. Oh, we're going to do some color, too, because uh, even though she's going to get a full sew-in, she may want to have a part, and she would want to leave some hair out and so forth. And so if we can get the color and so forth, you know, done and so forth, then we can just, like, kind of blend that for her and so forth so it'll look really, really natural, you know. 
and all that. So, anyway, Jenna is really excited about her sew-in and uh, her color, which is the most exciting thing she's excited about. But what I'm really excited about is getting in there and getting her hair done and uh, to take care of that damaged hair because that's, that's what I do. That's what I do. I love to go in and take care of the uh, damaged hair. Uh, that's my specialty is hair treatments and so forth, things like that. Also, sew-ins is also one of my uh, specialties as well. And so forth. So, uh, we're going to allow you to see this journey um, again with the hair and so forth. And I'm Eunice and I'm talking to you from the Charles Bay Hair Studio. And we'd like to wrap this up. And uh, so, uh, we'll get back with you on the second part of Helping sis with damage hat with my herbal treatment. Alright, thank you. Bye.